हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अरिना इंटरनेशनल मास्टर एंड फीडे इंस्ट्रक्टर ऋषिकेश चौहान वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडेज प्रैक्टिस गेम्स सो इट्स फाइव प्लस थ्री ब्लिट्स एज यूजल ओके गॉट ब्लैक लेट्स प्ले सिसल इन डिफेंस नॉर्मली आई प्रिफर टू प्ले सिसल इन ड्रैगन लेट्स सी Uh, here our opponent is playing uh, maroxibine structure so pawn on e4 and c4 this is maroxibine so let's continue with this i prefer putting the bishop sorry i prefer putting the bishop on this diagonal Now what I'm uh, trying to do, I want to put one knight on this square, and the other knight should join him, and that we will keep strong control of this uh, d4 square. Meanwhile, we'll try to exchange this bishop off. Okay. With pleasure. It should capture with okay. Uh, you can kick the queen away by playing this, uh, but if queen goes back, then again we don't have anything uh, bright after that. So let's continue with the development. We need a tempo so that we can get the knight on c6 on in time. He must go back to uh, d8. Yeah, of course. Now, if we press bishop e3, we are going to play any uh, c6. Okay, he prefers castling. We don't mind it either. Yes, as expected. Now, if you look at this position, uh, black has the strong control of d4. Uh, that way, uh, white wants. Uh, to control this d5 square, but that is why we have kept this e6 pawn so that uh, he cannot play uh, knight to d5. Okay, let's see. This queen cannot move anywhere because uh, all types of folks are coming up. Should we play knight c6 first or let's play this thing first because I want to play queen c7 but then uh, queen will be uh, kicked away uh, by this. Uh, we can try and knight, uh, sorry, queen a5, and after that we can try pushing the pawn. But I am worried about this uh, discovered attack. So let's play this thing first. I'm not sure if, uh, if this works. Okay, this knight is hanging, so we can play pawn into pawn, pawn into pawn, and then maybe we can give this check, right? That way we can pick up the knight. Again, I'm not sure. Is there a, is there a need to do that? Or maybe we'll let him capture uh, the pawn. That way we can uh, start pu uh, putting pressure on this backward pawn. But then even for us, this will be a backward pawn, right? B7. Okay, let's see what happens. If he pushes the pawn ahead, then wait. He can push the pawn ahead, right? Uh, 
Look, let's see what happens. I'm not sure about queen c7. I'm very happy with this position. The way we have placed our minor pieces. Yeah, okay. Should we let him capture? Let's continue with this. If he captures, we are going to recapture with the knight. So it was a good idea to move this rook away from this long diagonal. Compared to our opponent, we have uh, spent a lot of time in the middle game. Uh, but wherever it is required, you must spend uh, enough time. If you keep playing quickly unnecessarily, so we'll, you will find yourself in a very bad situation. Capture with the rook, so we can get the other rook here. Okay, I don't know uh, where is he going. Maybe he wants to shut down this bishop. Okay, let's try this. I wanted to play rook a8 uh, but again this uh, diagonal is risky. Okay, there are enough supports for this pawn, right? For this knight, two attacks, two defenses. We are happy. We got extra pawn. Uh, now we just need to activate our two remaining pieces. So it looks difficult to activate bishop through this diagonal. So what we are going to do? Move the rook away and then uh, activate the bishop through f8. As expected, pushed up on ahead. I wanted to play room B8 first. right in time
Ah. Oh, we blundered upon, man. We can capture. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, he can. He can't capture, right? We'll capture, he will capture, then we are going to play rook c2 check. And he should resign now. He, he overlooked that combination and the resignation should be on the way. Blended rook, it looks like. Yes, sir. Uh, the idea is let's go to analysis board and see what exactly is happening. Now, if he captures the queen, then there follows rook c7, uh, rook c2 check, any king move, and then we capture the queen back. And uh, we uh, got a free rook. We came up with the extra rook in this cal uh, calculation or combination, and that is why our opponent resigned. So, I hope you enjoyed this game. Of course, our opponent miscalculated and we got a free uh, rook, but uh, win is a win. So, I am not complaining and I hope you enjoyed this game. Thank you very much everyone.